Hello everyone, welcome to Seller's Choice Tutorial. This tutorial is about creating a shop on your Facebook page. In this tutorial, we'll learn how to create a Facebook shop, learn the two types of checkout, and add a product sale. First of all, we need to know what the shop section is. Well, the shop, the shop section is a tab you can add to your business page that lets you display products you're selling. It's ideal for merchants, retail, and e-commerce advertisers, advertisers who wants to reach more people on Facebook. What's great about this is that it's free to use and Facebook doesn't take any percentage of what you earn. So, your shop section will have di different features that depends on your geographic location. The shop sections lets you add products and, and product information. So that means you don't need to have a product catalog uploaded anywhere first. And there's no limit on how many products you can add. You can, uh, you can also curate and customize your shop's product inventory. You can divide your products into different collections to make it easier for customers browsing your shop. And you can also communicate with your customers directly from your page. Your customers can browse and message your page to learn more and buy from you. You can also get better distribution of your products. When you have a shop section, your products may appear in marketplace, allowing more people to discover them. Keep in mind this feature is gradually rolling out and may not be available to you yet. You can also get insights about your products. Depending on the type of shop you have, you can see how many views or messages you've gotten for each product. You may also be able to see views, clicks and purchases for each product, and money each product has earned you. Please be advised that Facebook itself doesn't have a payment gateway. So that means that the transaction doesn't really take place on Facebook. You can either place products on your shop and link it to a checkout page on your website, or you can also get customers informed about what you are selling and get them to chat with you about your product. By setting up a virtual shop, your customers can see details for each of your products. You also can add links to check out on your website with the help of Shopify. So let's get started. But before that, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. So I've created a page called Drones. Let's click on it. Now, this, I've created this page just for this tutorial. As you can see, you don't see the shop section here. So we need to go to settings. And let's add the shop page manually. So click edit page and scroll down. Right at the bottom, click the add tab. And select shop so once it's added it will disappear now let's close it and you can change the arrangement so let's put the shop here okay so everything's fine now let's go back to the Facebook page so as you can see, the shop is already here. So let's click it. And you will be advised to accept the merchant terms and policies. So put a check on I agree to the merchant's terms and policies. And then click continue. Now you will be directed to, to the select checkout method. There are two types, message to buy and check out on another website so for now let's just select message to buy now you need to select your currency let's put it at us dollars then 
click save now here's your Facebook shop yay so you can add description on what you're selling by clicking this link over here and let's add some products so this is where you can add uh, product description you can add photos or add videos so let's add some photos first so I've prepared um, a couple of pictures so let's drag and drop it and let's use this for photos so let's add a description drone dash 1080p so let's set up a price let's say let's put in 159.99 so to make the product more appealing let's put it as a sale so and let's put in 149.99 so you can add uh, the description and you can also share this on your page so let's add a couple of variation um, let's add a couple of colors by doing this you can click edit options and then click add option so you can just add a color here uh, there's actually a couple of variation so um, you can just select one of those but for now just select color so let's put in jet black and navy blue so here are the two variation um, okay let's set up the price for the jet black and uh, navy blue let's put jet black at a higher rate and navy blue at a cheaper one click save so here it is you'll see two prices uh, both has its original price and the sale price so this one here is for the jet black and the other one is for the navy blue we need to make sure that all of our product is in stock right now it's still out of stock so let's change it let's click edit option and make sure that in the inventory all of this is in stock so click apply and then save so this is where you can see the product it's already listed here on your shop so let's try and check the page as a as a visitor so let's go to shop okay and so as you can see here you can see the message button because earlier we have selected message to buy so your customer would need to message you to purchase the item so we're done with the message to buy uh, type of checkout method so let's try the other checkout method which is to check out on another website so first of all we need to delete this shop first and let's uh, after it's deleted let's click on shop again then you'll be asked to agree to the terms so let's agree to it and click continue so let's check this check out another website option okay so same currencies so the only difference is the checkout URL uh, if your customer wanted to uh, buy out the product um, they will be directed to the website or your checkout website so you can actually do this by the help of Shopify Shopify can customize your checkout and you can try their services for free for the next 30 days so this concludes our tutorial in setting up an online shop in Facebook. For more videos like this, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. See you soon.